Hello welcome everyone to our video on update of coronavirus treatment. Until there are more than 145,000 cases and 5,000 are died and more than 72,000 are recovered from infection. Rapid increase in recovered number is due to patient immunity and supporting care. Let's talk about treatment. Up to date there is no treatment. No drugs or vaccine have yet been approved against the virus. But good news is, drugs are being developed for the COVID-19 that means the clinical trial are being conducted. This is how drugs get from the lab to the market, first development then drug development phase and last FDA approval. For more information on this topic, watch video link in description. Now on this page, we are talking on the development of new treatments and vaccines for COVID-19. First round they swear by Gilead Sciences. Gilead has been developing Remdesivir, an antiviral that's shown promising results in lab and animal studies against SARS, MERS, Ebola and other infectious diseases, including COVID-19. The company has initiated clinical trials in the US and China. A World Health Organization assessment from February described Remdesivir as the most promising candidate against COVID-19. Second is Lopinavir, or Ritonavir, by Abvi. Abvi manufactures the co-formulation drugs, which is used to treat HIV. They are working with health authorities such as the CDC, WHO, and the National Institutes of Health, regarding testing. Third is potential mRNA vaccine by Moderna. Moderna has developed a potential mRNA vaccine against COVID-19. The vaccine works by getting the immune system to develop antibodies against a spike protein found on the virus. A batch of the vaccine has been manufactured and delivered to the NIAID for a first round of testing. Fourth is Johnson & Johnson's approach to prevent the COVID-19, it's developing a vector-based vaccine, a method that led to the effective Ebola vaccine. Though this vaccine is still in the preclinical research phase, meaning it hasn't yet been tried in humans. 1504800 by Inovio Pharmaceuticals uses a DNA vaccine approach, meaning Eno4800 delivers synthetic genes into a person's cells. Those genes could increase recipients' immune response to COVID-19. Eno4800 is in the preclinical phase of testing. There are some old treatments may get a new life with COVID-19. There are trials underway using existing drugs as well, such as antivirals like lopinavir and ritonavir, which are HIV drugs to treat COVID-19. Next is Oseltamivir drugs sold under the brand name Tamiflu, to treat influenza. Another is chloroquine, a drug used to treat malaria. Next one is Octemra, the drug used in testing of the anti-arthritis. The clinical trial of this all drugs are being conducted. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe.